Hi everyone, it's me Lina again. Welcome to my YouTube channel and thank you a lot for checking my videos out. And today in this video I would like to make a review on TV show called Blood and Water. So I recently saw advertisement on Netflix that it's gonna, you know, be there. And I was like, yeah, I might check it out. And I was thinking that probably I'm gonna like this show because it is something that looked like, you know, a mystery. It is actually a show for teenagers, I would say, but not necessarily only for them. I mean, like, that it is just teen show in some way. But it definitely has lots of mystery in it, and I found it also very, like, aesthetically pleasant. So I really like things like that. And yeah, I think the show is great. I really liked it. But first of all, I want to say that this video is gonna be full of spoilers. There are gonna be lots of them so if you are not ready for that just you know don't watch this video so i think this show is very different it is definitely like something that i still didn't like perhaps saw that much on netflix or in general i mean for example that the fact that it is apparently filmed in cape town is already quite a big scene and it is quite different for me for example since I'm so used to watch those American shows and also some British shows. So it was something different in a really good way. It was in some way even educative and I would say that it was like different, interesting to watch. So the show is a bit of like detective in my opinion still. The mystery is there and it is really something that sort of make you watch it make you curious and such. Also, I really like the area itself, all the little details which are very beautiful and I really like this visual key. I think that they did really a good job with that. Also, I thought that actors did very well. They are definitely very talented, good looking and yeah, in general, nice. Nice to watch, you know. <laughs> so, yeah. The show is interesting and something I would recommend, you know, for you to watch if you like teen TV shows and mystery TV shows. Something that is definitely eye-catching. So, well, <laughs> main character is very wise, smart, young girl. I would say that she's pretty too. And also, I really like how she's still like very kind, but she also sort of doesn't let her thoughts just go away. She sort of follows her emotions in some way, her heart perhaps, I would say. She tries to help her family to find out the truth about her long lost sister. Apparently, they believe that the baby was stolen. But also they sort of suggest that her father apparently sold her or something. I'm not sure. I guess I got everything correctly. And it is quite like creepy in some way too. And she really tries to do something about it in some way. She tries to find out the truth. She also has a younger brother. And her family seem to be semi-normal. Like they seem to be good people to me. And I actually like her family in some way. I mean, I hope won't turn out that there is something like even deeper secret in there somewhere you know so i like how she tries to do something nice but yeah she's definitely like quite you know a matter in all everything <laughs> in detective work let's put it this way so i like this part it seemed quite realistic too i mean the the detective part, not really the, you know, maybe the reason why she's doing this detective work in some way. Yeah, it is very interesting. I really like her. I think she's a nice girl. She's a kind person and such. Also, I like the main character, another one, the fix. The girl that, this other girl, the first one, what is her name? Pauline, maybe, the first one? I'm not sure how to pronounce it. I'm really sorry if I didn't pronounce it correctly. It's difficult for me. The names seem to be very different for me and I'm really not used to, you know, such names, such beautiful names. Uh, so also I want to say that I like another this character, the Fix. It is her nickname. 
her name actually is similar to that but yeah I think she's very determined girl and she's pretty she's very smart she's educated and she's just like she really has lots of goals which she trying to reach she doesn't want to rely on her parents money or on their maybe position in society in some way so I think it really makes her very likable in some way but also she definitely is not perfect and some people are seeing her as a very bratty person as I understood but I don't really think she's bratty she just wants to be loved and such also I think the fact that she is having an affair or I'm not sure how to call it with her coach the swim swimming coach because she's a swimmer she's like very good and yeah I think it is not good thing that she does but she's very young still so maybe she was manipulated in some way meaning that you know she's still young she wants to be loved probably she perhaps thinks that it is like true love and so on or maybe that it is something really like emotionally deep and such but I have this feeling that she obviously knew I mean it's not the feeling I actually think that she knew that he has wife I'm not sure if she knew that the wife was like pregnant but yeah I'm not sure but if she did it is quite messed up to be fine my opinion and making situation even worse I still like her because of how she wants to really sort of prove people that she can gain things without help of her parents and yeah I think it is making her really strong person I like other girls for example those two which are trying to also like gain some position in the school they are doing work very hard one of them is a bit of like doing it overworking it in a bad way but still I like how they are working hard to gain something because one of them came from this family which apparently is not that rich and such and she's in this school with lots of like rich kids and I like them they are doing it well and yeah I like the guy who is I think the son of principal I'm not sure though no I like him he's very sweet um, boy I think like a nice person yeah well it's a shame that the main character doesn't like him because he seemed to be like a nice person and such anyway I also like Chris even though he is quite like bratty he is very spoiled in some way and also selfish but I like him because he's very loyal in some way I like how he tries to really help his friend fix this girl he really does it so well and he is sort of doing whatever I like it I mean yeah it's perhaps not something really good in all the situations but I like this how he is really a good friend he's just sometimes he's doing bad things to help her but it's definitely something you know you are like wow it's amazing so in some way I like him also I like the other guy I don't remember his name but he has this father who apparently is involved in something bad but he seemed to be so nice and the guy seemed to be a very nice person too in my opinion he's very talented he's sweet he started to date this Pauline, uh, the, the main character. I'm not sure what is her name to be fair. I'm not sure how to pronounce it, sorry. And uh, yeah, I like him because he's like, they tried to show him as that he's sort of attractive inside and out, in my opinion. I'm not sure if it is his real personality, like still, but so far he seemed to be like a nice person, really and actually quite down to earth even with all those things he has and there are so many other people I like I think they are really like interesting personalities and such those characters but yeah I'm really curious what you think guys cause yeah this is why I'm making those videos I want to share my opinion and I want to perhaps read your opinion so let me know I want to say also that I'm looking forward for season 2, I hope there are gonna be such, but to be fair, 
I really hope that it won't turn out that Fix is her sister of the main character. I wouldn't like it. <laughs> I don't know why. I want more drama, more... something different. I'm not sure. Yeah, let me know what you think, your opinion. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and give this video some thumbs up. I'll see you soon.